welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna show you my favorite recipe for breakfast. As you know, I am always on the go, always trying to fit in a training session before. So for me, breakfast, it is the most important meal of the day. Apart from the fact that I love any breakfast food, uh, it is also usually my post-workout meal pre-first morning meeting uh, sort of fuel and so for me it is very important to have something always ready that I can pick up from the fridge and have it for starting my working day. So today I'm gonna show you my to-go recipe and something that I love to prep in advance that I can keep in the fridge ready to go is overnight oats. Sounds boring, but today I'm gonna show you three different ways in which you can make your overnight oats. It's so delicious, you're gonna look forward to your breakfast. The base is the same for every recipe that I'm gonna show you. You're just gonna need oats. I use protein powder for flavor actually, consistency, and also to add a little bit more protein into my breakfast because as I said, it's my post workout meal. Then I use chia seeds, milk and then it just really depends how you want to flavor it so the first recipe is gonna be a black forest oats sort of thing the second one is gonna be a lotus blueberries and the third lemon and raspberries flavor let's start with the first one which involves chocolate and so it's gonna be my favorite your best friend for these kind of preparations is frozen fruit we live in the UK, fresh fruit is really expensive, really hard to find, so frozen fruit is really my best friend. I like to use these kind of containers because you can close them, but really if you have an old one, like this one was containing some kind of jam, and uh, I mean, just don't throw it away and try to reuse it. For the first Black Forest one, our fruit of choice are cherries. These oat meal flour from Prozis, which is already chocolate flavor, but otherwise you can use just oats and cocoa powder. I'm gonna add anyway. And so we start with one cup of flavored oats, one cup of normal, and I'm gonna use protein powder, some chocolate, chia seeds and we start adding the milk consistency should be still a bit liquid our fruit And that's it. We close it. And it's done. Ready to put in the fridge. For our second recipe, we're gonna need some lotus biscuits, or some plain oats. And I'm gonna use the soy protein isolate salted caramel flavor. And as a fruit of choice, some blueberries. So we add our oats. Sorry, I'm just trying to finish. <laughs> whatever is remaining in this bag. Then I'm gonna crumble the biscuits. Stir. One scoop of protein powder. We top it off with a lotus. For our third and final recipe, I'm gonna use these 
oatmeal flour lemon pie flavored again if you don't have it is not essential you can still use regular oats and and add some uh, lemon peels oh, it's a new one so good because the oat flour is already quite uh, has already quite a strong taste i'm just gonna use the vanilla protein powder which is uh, out of all the ones that I have is the one that it's a little bit more bland or at least it is not as strong. Got a couple protein powder. Chia seeds. Milk And we add raspberries This one like this I have my three breakfasts ready blueberries and lotus black forest aka chocolate and cherries lemon and raspberries so protein powder oat flour again this is not essential but it will make your life a lot easier when it comes to change your breakfast trying new flavors and make it a little bit less boring and a little bit more exciting to eat in the morning. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope I gave you some kind of inspiration. Thank you so much for being here and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!